Yo, what is going on people? Welcome to another Daisy Tools tutorial. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to actually upload something to the Daisy Steam Workshop. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go on to Steam, you want to go to Tools, and then you want to find Daisy Tools. Right click, install, and you'll click play game. Once that's done, it'll open you to the folder like this and you go in bin and then you go to publisher and then you double click on the .exe once you have done that it'll come up with this now the first thing you want to do is make the visibility public the editing type is a mod the tags you can add terrain if it's a map if it's a weapon you add weapon, if it's a vehicle you add vehicle, you get the idea. Now as you can see I've got Lakeside and my name of the map is Lakeside, you can change this to what you want. Down here, this is your description, so whatever you put here I'll show it. And then where it says browse here, that is your picture so what you want to do say you want to select your folder see my folder is not here what you would have to do is you have to click that click that folder there go to wherever your mod is click on the actual full folder or whatever you want to select click OK then click agree and then click upload yeah it's that easy you can put links in here it's that easy now if we're gonna go on to my workshop page so if we go new comments Lakeside. Now you see this, you can edit links. So this is your Twitter, your YouTube, you can have Reddit, Facebook, all that lot. It's all there. You can also obviously change your description and if you click add images and videos as you can see you can attach a YouTube video wherever it is you can put it on and to upload images you click choose files and then it will take you to where your pictures are say so, and then you would double click on that picture and then it should say upload then you click save and continue and then that will be done you've got your visibility here so you can make it hidden public or whatever you want and obviously you've got your comment section. So I hope you enjoyed this little quick tutorial. I hope it helps people. Thanks for watching.